The purpose of this day for life is to speak up for the most vulnerable in our society through prayer, action, advocacy, and fellowship with one another. But today should not be the only day we stand up for life. As students at Notre Dame, we are called to be a force for good. This means we need to speak out and take action every single day. At Notre Dame, because of our Catholic mission, we don't pick and choose who should receive our love, support, moral concern, and the protection of the law. Everyone counts. We extend our hand to all in need, unborn babies, their mothers, their families, before and after they are born. Notre Dame's continuing witness is thus an important beacon and a voice needed not just in this country, but in the global public square and in international academia. There can be no genuine international human rights movement that is supposed to be anchored on human dignity that would ever leave the least protected, the completely unheard, and the most vulnerable, the unborn child, behind. We are building a culture of life by embracing and bearing witness to what grounds and animates it. Love. Unconditional love. Uncalculating love. Love without limits. Self-emptying love. Loving your neighbor. Loving moms in need. Loving their babies. Loving their families. Loving each other. And loving those who disagree with us. Those who support abortion. Those who have abortions. Those who perform abortions. Love without exception. As Mother Teresa said, we belong to each other. The culture of life leads to the creation of a civilization of love where everyone counts and no one is left behind, as Pope Francis has reminded us many times. That is what we're doing. And what better place to do it than at the Blessed Mothers University. <laughs>